Hey everybody, this is Eric with Pew Pew Podcast at WonderCon 2015. We're here asking some cosplayers some questions, some really tough questions, really get down to the nitty gritty. Um, and some of them just took their cosplay a little too seriously. I'm here with the Belcher Kids, Jean, Louise, and Tina, Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy, Leah Rose, pew pew pew, and I'm here with Aspen Comics. And she's here uh, dressed as Daenerys. Targaryen. I'm here with the this R2 unit. Alexandria the Red. Who's dressed as? Mad Moxie. I'm keeping an eye out for Lannisters. If you see any Lannisters, please direct them my way. So if people are mixed feelings about Ben Affleck being the next Batman, if you were to select the next actor to be Batman, barring any previous actors or voice actors, who would it be? He's got the chin, that's all that matters. Me. I am the knight. I'm gonna go with my sister on that. Luis. I wanna change my answer to my sister. Yeah! Rosie, O'Donnell. Rosie O'Donnell. We should get Tom Cruise so nobody will be pissed off about any other casting choice ever. <laughs> nobody knows who Batman really is. Regular or extra crispy? Like Anakin? Oh, come on! Double crispy. Always crispy. Everything crispy. 100% crispy. Uh, extra crispy. Extra crispy. Uh, 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 both? You know what, just because I noticed that a lot of you in non-Westeros like crispy, I'm going to say crispy. I will try your crispy wares. What, wait, depends what we're talking about. What are we talking about? That's regular or extra crispy? Regular. You're my first regular. Yeah. If you could pick any series, movie, whatever, anime, whatever you want, to turn into, to have Telltale turn into a game, what would it be? They might actually do a really good, like, um, like a good uh, Xavier's Academy for Gifted Youngsters, like an X-Men spinoff one. That would be really cool. I'd love to see a game where you get to choose what sort of walk you'd like to do, followed by a choice of which look at the end of the runway. So, oh, sweet man. If you can do a Venture Brothers game, I will spend so many gold dragons on that. A Venture Brothers game by Telltale, oh, would be beautiful. It'd be witty, it'd be funny, it could be sexy. Probably Translucid. Have you read Translucid? Are you are you serious? I'm so serious. You can tell them. It's my favorite book I've read all year. Translucid was one of my favorite books the last year too. So. Did you cry when Mufasa died? Yes, I did. Can you can you imagine to watch a film like that? You are getting involved in the hero's story. You think he's going to make it. He's going to escape. You have your hopes up, and suddenly he trips, falls, and his head is crushed by wildebeests. I don't think I understood what had actually happened. I was very convinced that he was going to wake up. No. Scar fan. Mm -mm. Can you imagine watching your favorite character just get crushed by like a mountain's worth of beasts? If you were to choose one of your senses to live without, which sense would it be? Balance. The sense of smell. My toes just stink all the time sense of smell because his toes just stink all the time. I'm gonna go with smell too because I enjoy touching butts. I enjoy looking at butts. I enjoy feeling butts. It's probably smell. I don't like smelling butts. Probably taste. It would be my sense of direction. I'm trying to figure out whether you have better direction or less. Either way, somebody's telling me where to go, so I'm okay. This is gonna be the last question. This is a hard hitting one too. If you could change one thing that you thought was a mistake or be something absolutely brand new in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, what would it be? Let's just start with the easy one and cast me as Rogue. If you haven't seen, she does a really killer Rogue cosplay. The fact that Tony Stark created Ultron is both <laughs> More blood. I think the best thing they've done is to bring Spidey back into the fold. No, just stop. Stop it. Thank you so much. Yeah, you're Thank you so much, Leah. You're welcome. Thanks from WonderCon. I'd like to thank you for uh, answering these questions, or perhaps 